Before starting the video, I would like to tell you about the tool called ESIS Mobi Unlock. It's a one-click tool to unlock any kind of iOS screen lock, whether it's a disable screen, passcode screen, four or six digit pin, touch ID, face ID locks, and many more. So links in the description, you can check out the tool from there. After the installation, first you have to connect your device into the recovery mode or just follow the instruction on the screen. After that, just simply click on start. First, you need to import the IPSW of your device. So import the latest IPSW that is currently signed. After that, click on unlock and it will start unlocking your device. Now once it get done, just set up your device normally and your device will be completely unlocked. So if you are interested in this tool, you can check out the description link to know more about the tool and the official website. Now let's come to the topic. So in today's video, I will show you how you can bypass the iCloud activation lock screen on your GSM devices with SIM working, iCloud services working and everything will work like a normal device. I will show you the complete process like how you can do that on your Windows machine. So no need of Mac PC, you just require a windows machine and you can done everything on that and also there are some giveaways in this video so watch the video till the end to know more about the giveaway so let me just go to my computer screen and show you the complete process now the step number one you have to jailbreak your device with the checkrain jailbreak i have already made the several videos on the checkrain latest version that is the 0.12.2 so you can download the iso file from the description blog link or you can watch my dedicated video on the checkrain jailbreak to know more about First you need to extract the RAR file, after that you will get the ISO file in it and then you can make the USB bootable. For that you need to use the Rufus tool. So make sure that you will only use the Rufus for making the USB bootable with the custom checkering ISO file. Now just open the Rufus tool and you will require a USB stick. So just insert that and select the ISO file. Now after that you have to select your partition scheme whether it's a GPT or MBR. So you can select all this setting according to your computer. So I've already inserted the USB stick and I'm selecting the MBR. Now click on start and it will start flashing your USB stick and make the USB bootable. Now once the flashing process is completed, you need to reboot your PC and just go to your BIOS settings or a boot manager settings and select the USB stick from that and it will directly boot the checkrain from it. This BIOS settings or a boot manager setting might be different for your model. So you can search on the internet according to your laptop brand and then you will get the shortcut key to boot from your USB stick. After that, wait for the 5 seconds and it will load the checkrain automatically. Now after that connect your device and the first thing you have to go to the options from the checkrain settings and you have to allow the first option that is the allow untested iOS option and if you are having the iPhone 8, 8 plus like A11 devices you need to allow the skip A11 BPR check and then you can proceed. Now once you see all done on the screen that means the jailbreak is done. If you see any error you can try it again and then it will surely work. After that you need to quit from the checkrain app and then you will see the terminal down below and now you have to type the reboot and hit on enter and it will directly reboot your PC and then just unplug your USB stick and you will redirect to your Windows machine. Now once you are on Windows machine you need to download the bypass tool. So for all these downloaded you have to just check out the description link where you will find my blog link. You can just go there and download all this link very easily. So for this we will use the Strom activator. It's a latest 3.2 version so you can download it and use it for the bypass. It's a very fast and easy tool to bypass the iCloud activation lock screen on the GSM device without any issues. So I will show you the complete process now. Now here you will get all your device details like IMA number, model number, serial number, iOS version, devices activated or not. So you will get all this thing here so it will be easy to, for you to get all the information too. And for the giveaway I will choose the 5 lucky winners on this video from the comment. So you can comment there and I will choose and I will announce the giveaway result after the one week of this video on my all social media handles and YouTube community posts. So make sure you follow me all there for knowing the results. So now I will show you how you can actually do that and bypass and run the same network. It's a completely legit method. So I will show you the complete process now. 
Now once everything is set, you have to connect your device and click on the activate GSM and make sure that you will stay on the activation lock screen with the Wi-Fi connected and then your device will be getting vSpring so do not disconnect it until it get complete and other are these options for the disable OTA updates from the settings so you can check that if you want. Now in the last you will get to trust in the device so just open your device and hit on trust and click on ok and after that your device will be completely activated and you will get some message and after that you can easily reactivate your device and this time you won't see the activation lock screen you can directly skip that and just simply set up your device. Now everything is set, you can see we have successfully bypassed our device and it's fully activated now. You can see there is no Apple ID in the settings so you can use your own Apple ID account and in the check screen you can install the CDI if you want to jailbreak your device. And now I will just insert the SIM and see the SIM is working or not. So let me just open the SIM tray and insert the SIM. You can use any SIM like 3G, 4G, any network. Now after that you will see the signals on the top, if not just reboot your device and you will get the signals and you can see I am getting the signals now. So let me just call in the number and see the calling is working or not. Now you can see the calling is perfectly working so you can run any sim on it with the GSM devices. Now next I will reboot the device and see the bypass is fully unthreaded or not. So let me just reboot the device. Now the device is on again that means the bypass is completely untethered without any issues. So let me just sign in in my own Apple ID account and see the iCloud login is working or not. Now you can see the iCloud service is also working so you can use your own Apple ID account or create a new one to sign in from the settings also. Now let me show you the FaceTime is also working. So all the iCloud services will work like FaceTime or Siri and all the things like App Store also. So let me just try to call again and see the calling is working after the reboot also or not. Now the calling is also still working after we reboot the device. So let me just open the FaceTime and activate that. Now you can clearly see that the FaceTime is already activated and working. So everything will work. So let me check the Siri is working or not. Hey Siri, open the Safari. Now Siri is also working. Now many people ask me the data connection will work or not. So I have on my data. Now let me just open the any website. Now you can see your data connection is also working. So no need of Wi-Fi, data calling, everything will work with this method. So it's super easy to activate your device with this method. So you can try it and register your device very easily. So I've shared all the details with the registration or you can check out the description link. And this method is only for the GSM device. So for MEAD device, links in the description, you can refer these videos. And if you like the content, just hit the like button. And if you're new here, subscribe to the channel. So till then, goodbye, take care and peace out.